Hey everyone, today I wanted to do a video about super managers. So I have 11 so far and I've gotten these through buying them using green shards that I've collected from mainland mines. And I also have Santa Claus here at the top who I bought using super cash during the event this month. So I just wanted to show you guys how each of these managers works and give you some information about them because when you buy one of these managers, they're chosen at random from a pool at the bottom down here. And once you roll for a manager, you do have the chance to re-roll for another one if you don't want that one, but it'll cost you super cash. So I just wanted to show you guys how each of these managers works, and that way you can make a better decision on whether you would want to re-roll for a certain manager or not. So I don't have two of the super managers down here yet, so I don't have Chester, but he seems to do the same job as Gordon over here, who I'll show you how he works. And I also don't have Dr. Steiner. Um, he works in the mine shaft area, but I do have Dr. Louie who does the same job in the elevator area. Alright, so let's just enter one of the mainland mines and I'll show you guys how all of these managers work. Alright, so I've already put three managers into the mine shaft, the elevator, and the warehouse. So I've got Gordon in the mine shaft. Um, We've got Leva Tori in the elevator and Mark in the warehouse, and all three of these do the same job. They basically increase your mining and walking speed boost by five. So in this leftmost column here, you have the managers that increase your walking speed boost, and then in the second column there, you've got the ones that increase your mining speed boost. So these managers, uh, Gordon, Levatory, and Mark, they basically combine these and do both of those together at once. So I'm going to activate them all here. And as you can see, they're moving just a lot faster and mining a lot quicker, and they all last for five minutes. And that is basically what they do. So personally, I don't find these to be uh, particularly necessary to win any event mine or help you complete your mines. They are useful in speeding up things, but I don't think that they're necessary or I don't think that they're the best of the best super managers. So once these have run for five minutes, they take 30 minutes to cool down and then you can use them again. Um, but yeah, so those are those three. So I'm just going to move on to the next group of super managers, and that is the Goodmans. So in the mineshaft area, we've got Goodman Jr. In the elevator area, we've got Mrs. Goodman. And in the warehouse, we have got Mr. Goodman. And all three of these do the exact same thing as well. They all are cost reduction managers. So you've got cost reduction managers in this third column here. Um, but these ones will start at a cost reduction of 90%. And if you upgrade them, the cost reduction will increase. So for example, Goodman Jr. here is at 91%. So just to show you how these work, we've got Goodman Jr. in the mine shaft. And we're able to upgrade by 138 so if I just activate it and look now, now I can increase the mineshaft extraction by 138T. So just like that, and all of these will do the same thing. So you can see there, it's 268 billion, hit that, and we got 2.34 trillion. So these all do the same thing, they last for 5 minutes each, and these also regenerate after half an hour. So you can use them every half hour. Personally, I really do like these managers. I find that they're super useful in completing not only event mines, but also just helping you further mines in all your continents. And they work really well in conjunction with other super managers. So I really do like these. I think they're simple, but very useful. Uh, next, I'm going to show you guys one of the managers unique to the mine shaft, and that is Ranger Sue. So when you activate her, basically she runs for one minute and they say that the miners have an infinite worker capacity. So they mine for a minute straight and then they'll multiply that by 10 and then dump it um, at the mine and it'll be ready for the elevator to collect. So I think if you're trying to increase the amount of income that you're generating, Ranger Sue is useful in that regard. But overall, personally, I don't think she is super helpful. Um, I think she can cause a clog if you're not careful. But if you have her, great. However, I would not re-roll specifically for her. 
so she lasts for a minute and then you can reuse her every 15 minutes. So it's been about a minute and now you'll see that all the miners will come and bring 10 times the income. So you can see they just put about 130 AA, which was 10 times more than what was extracted. So that's how she works. Uh, the next one I'm going to show you guys is Mr. Turner. So Mr. Turner runs for 30 seconds and basically he'll, he'll collect gems for the 30 seconds and then, and then after that he will multiply that by 10 and send it directly to your warehouse so you get that income right away. I personally really do like Mr. Turner. I think he's super useful for just sending money straight up. Uh, one thing to note is that he does not work in conjunction with Boost, so uh, don't expect it the money that you you earn from him to also be multiplied so you can see it was about 5.2 aa and it got boosted to 6.2 sorry 62 aa and it went straight into my income at the very top um so he does multiply your income by 10 times when you first get in but i've upgraded him that's why he multiplied my income by 11.9 um, and he takes 15 minutes to regenerate and then you can use him again and again. I really do like him. I think he is really worth the money and he is useful in completing event mines and just, and just for use in all your other mines. Also, one note about Mr. Turner is I highly recommend that you activate him when the miners are walking towards him. So right now they're mining, mining, and I would activate it now. So that that way you get the max income out of using him. If you start if you start activating him when the miners are walking away from him, you might potentially get less than what you could have. So just a little side note about him. But anyways, the next manager that I want to show you is one of my absolute favorites, and that is Blingsley. So basically, he lasts for a minute. Basically, what he will do is he'll multiply the income that you gain. By 10 times every five seconds and send it straight up to your income at the very top um, and he, what is especially great about him is that he works in conjunction with boost so if you use any of like the two times five times 20 50 whatever he works with that and it'll multiply your income exponentially and the other great thing about him so as I activate him here so you'll see I'm able to upgrade the mine shaft that he's working on at the same time that he is sending money up. And if you use him like this, you can really exponentially increase the amount of income that you generate in one minute. So we started off making a lot less income in this mine shaft, and now we're already at. 178 AD per second, which is a lot higher than what we started with. Uh, so that's Blingsley, and he regenerates after 30 minutes, so you can reuse him again. So that is all the mineshaft managers that I have, and I'm going to show you now the other elevator manager that I have, which is Dr. Lily. Um, Dr. Lily is one of my absolute favorites as well. Her and Blingsley are definitely my top two recommendations for um, if you have a choice of getting any super managers, I would go for those two. I think they will help you the most in all your mines, especially event mines. What she does is she will run for five minutes and basically go to each mine shaft and multiply that amount that you've, you're collecting by three times and zap it all the way to the warehouse so you get that money right away. And I've just upgraded her to zap 3.2 times of the resources but the other thing that's great about her is that she works in conjunction with boost as well so if you've got boost going on that income will be further multiplied uh, so if we just activate her here we will see so it's going to take some of the income from there and just zap it to the top and so if i upgrade this mine shaft so now it's able to collect 29 AE, and if you look at my shards at the top, you'll see it go up by about three times that amount. We're going up by about 100 AE, 
And what's great about her is as she is running, you can also upgrade the elevator and then she collects more and more. And this, she works really great if you use her in conjunction with like a cost reduction manager or Gordon on one of the mine shafts. So you're getting more money from the mine shafts and that way you can upgrade the elevator even more. I highly recommend that if you have a chance of getting Dr. Lily to re-roll for her, I think she is one of the best. Uh, so she takes half an hour to regenerate and then you can use her again. All right, the final manager that I'm gonna show you here in the warehouse is Santa Claus. So Santa Claus is one manager that you get from, that you don't buy with gems, but I've got him from the event this month using super cash. Um, honestly, he costs quite a bit of super cash and I don't necessarily think he is worth the amount of super cash that he cost, but I'll just show you guys how he works. So he will take money from the elevator and multiply it by four and they call it turning it into presents and then that way you're just able to get four times the income. So so the elevator is collecting 14.7 T each so you can see it's multiplying it by four and we're at 59.3 T. So that's what Santa Claus does. Um, do I think he's super useful? Not really. I think he can help, but definitely not near, but definitely not nearly as close as Blingsley or Dr. Lily. All right, so those are all the super managers that I have. If you have any questions about any of them, feel free to let me know. There are other super managers in the game, which I don't have from the Impossible Continent and uh, Sir Henry, which you can buy for real money. Um, but if you have any questions, feel free to let me know in the comments below and I will try my best to answer you guys. And if you enjoyed this video, please subscribe to my channel. I would really appreciate it. Hope you guys have a great day. Bye.